I thought that was like very festive. Oh, my alarm's going off. Hey guys, so I decided to vlog today. It's early and it's Thanksgiving. So I'm gonna vlog my Thanksgiving, even though I'm gonna be at work for a lot of it. This vlog is gonna be something, but I'm doing Vlogmas, so I thought I would need to like figure out how to do this again. So mm, let's do my day. I'm gonna go make pancakes. Um, we're starting off the day with a chocolate chip cookie before I make myself pancakes. Living our best lives. Here we are. Air fry, whole food, and they're very good. And I bought a whole box with the intention of bringing it to work to share with people. No. Look at my pancakes. Well, they're gonna be pancakes. Um, I just used this mix thing that I got from Trader Joe's, and then I have an egg replacer thing that my grandma got me like two years ago that I never found a use for until pancakes. So let's snap to the final product, shall we? They are done. There's like one underneath here and that's about all it made. I made like half of the serving because the servings for like four people. So I'm like, I can eat for two people. But then I'm just gonna add some maple syrup on here. It's from Trader Joe's. Ta-da. I'm gonna add a lot. Yeah, living my best life. Here we go. I also changed outfits while I was making this because I have to leave for work in like 20 minutes and the pancakes took longer than I thought. So I needed to be ready to leave. I'm gonna do a taste test here. Got some syrup on it. Here we go. Okay. I wanted chocolate chips in there. I got these chocolate chips from like Trader Joe's, but I ate them as snacks, unless it's like in a pancake, so. But I'm gonna eat this, and then I'll see you guys after done. And I remember just thinking like, there's no one else I'd rather be with right now than with you guys. So that was a rough night. And then fast forward since then, but finally I'm like, I'm, I'm over it. Hey guys, so this lighting is um, god awful. Let me see if I can. Slightly better? Yeah, okay. So I'm at work right now. Um, I'm gonna go in. It's 9 at 22. I have to be in at 9.45. I definitely thought I was gonna be late. Like, I like to give myself like an hour to get here just in case, but there was no traffic at all because everyone else is at home sleeping in their pajamas and eating food. But it's gonna be a good day. I'm excited. This is my first shift doing the thing. I don't know how much I can say about it. I might update later, but basically I'm at work. I can't really say much about what I'm doing, but it's really fun and it's my first time doing it, so I'm very excited. Flash forward to next time I'm filming. Okay, bye. Hey guys, so I'm all done with my shift today. Everything went really well and I'm super excited about it and everyone was super nice and we got through working on Thanksgiving together so that was really nice. As of right now, I'm gonna head home. It's almost five o'clock. I'm not hungry yet. I actually kind of had a headache. So I took a couple Advil and I took three because they're expired, which means they're not as effective. So I took three. Um, we're gonna see how that works but I have a little bit of a headache. I'm drinking a ton of water and I ate a bunch of food for lunch so I don't really know why but Hey, just his life. So I'm gonna head home, but I did get some clips on my way out of work that I will insert right over here. Um, just, it's so beautiful. Um, the Wizarding World in London during this time of year, the lights are all pretty and stuff. Um, so I wanted to show you guys because I just thought it was really pretty. So hope you guys enjoyed. And I'm gonna head home now. So see you back at the humble abode. All right, friends. So I am home now and I just shoved two cookies into my face because I like walked in the door and I was like, I need cookies. If you've ever felt like that, please let me know that I'm not alone, but I really, really needed those cookies. So I'm gonna start preparing my Thanksgiving dinner. I don't think it's gonna take that long to prepare. And so like, I don't really wanna eat it yet because it's like 5.30. I also kind of just wanna eat it. So we're just gonna make it. Most of the stuff just needs to go in the microwave, but I'll show you guys what I got. So we opened my fridge and up first, is our vegan pumpkin pie. It was $6, which is like more than I'd spend normally on a pie, I guess, but you know, it's Thanksgiving, live your life. I also got this little box of things from Whole Foods. It's like butternut squash with uh, cranberries, some onions or something, broccoli with onions, we love an onion, and some garlic green peas that I just got as like a little side dish. We have this. Also into my freezer, we have a mac and cheese. It's a vegan gluten-free mac and cheese. It's pretty good. I'm pretty sure I've had this one before, but you know, another side because we're living a side life because they were out of tofurkey, like rude. And then we've got one potato that I'm going to make into a mashed potato for one. I don't have any gravy, but mm, we'll just use salt and ketchup per normal. Don't hate me. Let's just get started on this Thanksgiving a feast, which I will start making mashed potatoes because that part is going to take the longest, I think. So I just finished the mashed potatoes. I'm going to show you. They look beautiful. So here we go. They look cute. I think you can use the word cute to describe mashed potatoes. They're creamy and stuff. I just used a fork to like squish them. Um, and I also used this Almond Breeze original stuff. This is, last time I like made mashed potatoes, I made them with vanilla, which was not awful, but I would prefer just regular Almond Breeze. That's what I used there. And then I used this Earth Balance vegan butter. You don't really need to, like you can really make mashed potatoes and just use the water that was in it and then just use that. But you know, we're going all out today. So I thought, why not use the, uh, the extras? So now that our taters are mashed, 
I didn't, I did not like that. So now that our mashed potatoes are mashed, um, <laughs> I'm going to put the mac and cheese into the microwave, get out the veggies, and then put those in the microwave, and then um, make a plate. So we'll see what the plate looks like when it's done. See you when it's done. You guys, I did it. It looks so much better than I thought it would. So we have mashed potatoes, obviously. We have mac and cheese, obviously. These are like garlic green beans from Whole Foods. This whole section is like a Whole Foods hot bar section. So garlic um, green peas things. Broccoli with onions and then the butternut squash with red onions and then there's cranberries and walnuts in there I thought that was like very festive So this is the spread and then add the pumpkin pie at the end and I think I did Thanksgiving pretty well for just being by myself and cooking this in I guess technically what maybe 20 minutes So so I'm gonna go eat this and then take a picture for Instagram because that's just who I am as a person And uh, I'll see you guys afterwards. I'm so excited. This looks so good So I just ate and it was uh, really really good The mac and cheese was a lot better than I remember it being and then my parents texted me they're like, oh, is that real cheese? And I'm like, what do you mean by real cheese? And they're like, a moo cow cheese. And I said, nope, this one's better. And they said, well, we'll let you, we'll let you think that type of deal. And I'm like, okay, whatever. Anyways, <laughs> yay. So I'm about to make, make, I'm about to cut this um, vegan pumpkin pie. In my mind, I will only be having mm, a slice, maybe half of this tonight. In my heart, I know myself. And uh, yeah, this is not going to last until tomorrow because tomorrow there will be a new video about this up um, in a couple days. But tomorrow I'm going to be starting on a health and mental health journey. And I was trying to start it earlier this week and it just like was not happening. So I told myself that I would give myself until Thanksgiving and then hop right into it. So I'll go more into that in a later video that should be up in a few days. So that's what's going to happen. I'll explain more of that. But for now, like I said, I know myself very well, and myself. We'll take out half of this to eat, and then we'll come back at, oh, it's only 6.30. Oh yeah, I'm going to eat this whole thing today. Okay, so at least we know ourselves now. So I don't even know how to like cut this. How do you even do this? Mm, I need a knife. Okay, so I have knife. And so we're going to saw into my pumpkin pie. Funny story about <laughs> pumpkin pie. Um, funny story about the Whole Foods pumpkin pie. Two years ago, I spent um, Thanksgiving in New York because my sister and her now husband, congratulations, man, they just got married like literally last weekend. We were up there to visit them for Thanksgiving. All I wanted for Thanksgiving was a vegan pumpkin pie from Whole Foods because I never had one before and I just like never had had pumpkin pie that was vegan and I really, really wanted one. So we never had a chance to go out to go get one until like the day of and that was all I wanted because like I was at basically a Korean Thanksgiving which is really cool because it was like an American slash Korean Thanksgiving so there was American food and Korean food which meant I could eat actually some of the stuff because I can eat a lot of the Korean stuff so my sister's boyfriend is a boyfriend oh my god my sister's husband is Korean so that that's that whole thing that's his family made the food so I wanted a vegan pumpkin pie the day of I hadn't been able to get one and so I think we ended up calling Whole Foods or like they went out to Whole Foods because they were like doing other things they were running errands and they were sold out of pumpkin pie. That was the only thing I really wanted. So every year since, I think I got one last year. I don't remember. This year, if, I, if anything else, I need to get myself a pumpkin pie. And we have got a pumpkin pie where I'm going to only eat half of it, right? No. So we're gonna take the first bite here so I can go back to watching pointless YouTube videos per normal. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so now that I am Completely satisfied with my gear. I'm gonna finish this half of the pumpkin pie and wait till later to finish the other half. So see you guys wanna do something else productive. Oh, this was a really long clip, so you're welcome. So as I'm sure that there were many of you who did not believe me when I said I would eat my whole pumpkin pie in one night, it's now eight o'clock. And I'm ready to eat the other half. I just did a live stream on my Instagram where you can find it um, right over here. I'm gonna put the thing. Um, so go follow me there. But I just did a live stream where I basically played piano for about four people because everyone's doing family things tonight. Obviously, that's where you should be. But for those who are lonely like myself, um, I did a live stream and just played a bunch of Taylor Swift songs because I'm in a mood. And yeah, so now I'm gonna eat. And I'm gonna find a movie to watch on Netflix because I have not had time to do a single thing basically all semester. I was so busy with spring awakening and with school and with work and with being a god a person in Orlando. I'm so busy all the time and also YouTube and stuff. I do that a lot. I had not had time to like sit down and watch a show or read a book and I was reading a book last night so I'm gonna finish that like when I go to bed. I'm gonna start reading it. Dear Santa, Kate no, shh. Netflix was really intense. But basically, I've not had time to like read or watch TV shows or movies, which is like, I really enjoy it, but um, I haven't been able to, so I'm gonna watch a movie. I was suggested to watch a uh, Christmas Wedding Planner, which I think is exactly what we're going to do because I need a rom-com in my life. So that's the mood. I'm gonna eat my pumpkin pie and I'll see you guys 
when I'm hopefully crying after this movie. Update, that movie was awful. I think I watched maybe 20 minutes of it and I just really not good. So not recommended. I also started watching the show Insatiable because like I'd heard good things about it. Um, excuse my acne. I just started watching that and also I just like, I got like maybe a quarter of the way through the first episode and I just didn't, I didn't like it. I wasn't interested. I didn't care. The guy interest person was cute. Not the older man, but like the, the teenage boy. Um, he was cute. Um, but that was about all I could handle of that show. So I'm like, nope. So now I'm watching YouTube and I'm just going to shut off this vlog here because I want to go to bed and just watch YouTube. So I'm gonna end this vlog here. But thank you guys so much for watching. Honestly, this is like, I didn't really do much today. I think, I mean, I worked and I like made food and stuff, but like, I don't know. If, if this is exciting content to you, let me know. Cause this is a lot of what you guys are gonna get during Vlogmas. I'm gonna try and do more exciting things. Like I am moving and I am graduating and I do have things like that, but I work and at work I can't film. So it's a little bit difficult, but I just wanted to make a little video for you guys because I think that you guys like vlogs and I like making them even if my day is boring. But thanks for watching them if you're not already please subscribe to my Instagram as well. Follow me if you're not subscribed already. Blah, 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 blah. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Talk to you then. Au revoir. Okay, bye. I see